Green grind high, you live with it. It's a kid ready to kid. I'm back with another reaction video. The video for the reaction to is a new death battle. This is Beerus versus Sailor Galaxy. This is Dragon Ball versus Sailor Moon. If you find my channel the first time, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share our social media. Follow my Instagram, Andrew Two Point Kid underscore. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what's going to next, man. Shout out to all the shadow ninjas out there. All that have a cash app. Don't know your channel. Help channel. Link for the description below. Uh, two things. Number one, this is not the full video. I want to react to the actual death battle. You know, you want to watch the full video. You know, you know, go to death. You know, go to death battle and do that. But and also, you know, my uploads is gonna be pretty much the weekend. Who well, I think gonna win this beers? But enough of our talking. Let's get to the video. <laughs> it's unwise to vaporize a god's dessert. <laughs> Witness my infinite power. Uh. So you have chosen death. Oh. <laughs> Interesting. Apparently, I found a worthy foe. Uh -huh. ha, the hard way it is, then. Don't you dare. <laughs> now look what you've done! This is your fault, you stupid cat! Hello there, stranger. Welcome. Uh. Kneel for me. Hello there, stranger. Welcome. You're no match. You lack the instinct. You're trash! You'll die like dirt! <laughs> You're all mine! What? That's impossible! Now you're catching on! I am the impossible! <laughs> Boom, baby! That was for my ice cream. Yeah, <laughs> of course. KO! Holy crap! This fight was so intense! I'm gonna get a beer for us! Wait. Beer us? Whiskey? Champagne? Oh my god! All the cats are named after booze! I like them now. 
this was a fairly balanced matchup. Galaxia's power set was certainly enough to keep up with Beerus. Especially since she has so many more versatile techniques than him. Not to mention her crystal provided unlimited energy while Beerus had a vast but still finite pool of ki. But that's about where it all starts tilting the other way. Based on how fast their galaxy spanning attacks were, Galaxia did have a slight edge in attack speed, but Beerus's ultra instinct made up for it. Plus, he had expert martial arts training, while Galaxia had none of that. Speed alone wasn't winning this fight. Also, Beerus's skill set countered many of her own attacks. His energy nullification, for example, let him blast through plenty of her offensive options. But to really lock down Beerus' superiority in all things destruction, how about we compare their power output? Both of them used attacks that spanned their whole universe in seconds. But remember, the Dragon Ball universe is much bigger than our own. Right, this universe is at least nine times bigger than ours, and Beerus almost destroyed it all. For the most part, the universe in Sailor Moon is very much based on our own. And the same should be said for Nehalenia's mirror universe Usagi destroyed. So, pretty clear cut? That means Beerus is nine times stronger than Galaxia? Well, not exactly. They both are likely much stronger. Galaxia matched Endgame Eternal Sailor Moon in battle who could destroy eight of her Animamate minions at once. Did you say Animorphs? Long story short, a single Animamate could match a Sailor Guardian equal in power to Sailor Moon when she destroyed that mere universe. While this is admittedly a very highball estimate, defeating eight Animamates at once could logically translate to possessing eight times that power. Since Galaxia could match her in combat, this potentially puts Galaxia's output level much closer to Beerus and Goku's clash. But the shockwave happened when Goku had only just gone Super Saiyan God for the first time. Beerus claimed he was going all out with 100% of his power, but like all cats, he was lying. Telling Goku that you were using 100% of your power was a very clever tactic to draw out his full strength, even though it wasn't true. Even after Goku later achieved Super Saiyan Blue with Kaioken, a form many, many times more powerful than his first go at being a redhead, Beerus was still considered his superior. Simply put, even if we highball Galaxia and lowball Beerus, the God of Destruction still possessed a greater amount of power, both in offense and defense, as they are identical when it comes to Dragon Ball Ki. Isn't that right, dummy? Sailor Galaxia may have had a more versatile arsenal, but Lord Beerus had the strength, durability, and technique needed to overpower her. But you already said all that. So what's the point? Like my existence. You could say she got caught in a galaxy-sized catastrophe. Can I blow him up this time? I look forward to it. The winner is Lord Beerus. Death Battle is back with 10 episodes to wrap up this year. Stay tuned and check out the music linked in the description below. <laughs> okay. That's going to be a good one. Well, this is the video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share on social media. Remember, everything's going to the underground takeover, man. Let's get it.